as I've just done my makeup on my everyday makeup routine, I thought I'd just do a little haul for you. Start off with the boring things. I went to Home Bargain, which is a very cheap shop here in the UK, and I bought Nivea Pearl and Beauty, and that was a pound, just for a deodorant, and it smells absolutely gorgeous. And I also bought Charles Worthington Dream Air, and this is a moisturising, miraculous, well, a miraculously moisturising hair mask, and that was one pound. It's either £1.49 or £1.99 and I've liked everything that I've used from that range up to now. The Dream Hair. I love Charles Worthington. And then from my boots, uh, well not, not my boots but from the boots in Sheffield City Centre, I bought the Mat Rimmel Match Perfection. Um, skin Tone Adapting Concealer. It's a two-in-one concealer and highlighter and it's in 010 Ivory. It's got a brush which I have used because I wanted to swatch it. That is a very light swatch. As you can see it is a, a, definitely a medium to full coverage and looks really nice, especially for the, under the eyes. Um, from my Morrisons, well Morrison's what's just down the road. I've got two packets of boring cotton wool pads but I would de definitely recommend them because as you can see there's no pilling so you don't get any bits stuck in your eyes or on, on your face especially when you're trying to take eye makeup off it can be a nightmare. So uh, but I've been wanting a red nail varnish for a good while now. I've got some reds but it's not the red that it's not the type of red that I've been wanting and I wanted a red red like a primary red and I got Rimmel's I Love Lasting Finish in Double Decker Red and I just love the colour, er, the name and I think the colour is just perfect and it clashes with my skin tone so the contrast is so massive look how pale I am compared to that red and it looks brilliant it actually does look really nice and on the toes it's just absolutely gorgeous and I can't wait to get that on with my sandals it's going to look so nice Oh yeah, also from uh, Morrison's I bought Garnier's Caffeine Anti-Dark Circles 2-in-1 Tinted Eye Roll on in fair skin tone. Which looks like that and swatches like that and that's just one little roll. So I don't know how you're supposed to really give yourself a good massage without putting on too much product. I don't know. Give it a try. Let you know what I think. Then I ordered a couple of things from Avon. I ordered a Summer Breeze Shower Gel, which is the new shower gel for summer, and it smells really nice. A bit citrusy. I got the Hervey Lager, or the Hervey Lager uh, perfume sample. I got an, a new Solar Advanced Face Lotion, and it's an SPF of 50. It's it incorporates uh, sun care with skin care, so it protects your face while wrinkles dramatically reduce. We'll see how that is. That's the little Hervey Leisure. I wanted to say Hervey Leisure, but I'm not sure, sure it's Hervey Liga, Hervey Liga. Mm, I don't know. But the thing that I ordered from um, Avon is this um, lipstick in satin sheets, and it's one of the new ones. I forgot what it's called something seduction I think but it smells like fruit and vanilla and that's the twist what they've got on this one and the colour is actually a lot brighter than what I thought it was uh, the fo that I thought it would be that's it um, I'll give you a swatch it's it's a really nice medium pink and it's it's in between I'd say it's more cool. I'd say it's a more of a cool tone. It reminds me of Gargo, but this has a little bit more... I think Gargo's a little bit lighter and a little bit more cooler tone. But apart from that, because I've got Gargo, yeah, no. It's not really that much like it. When it's on my lips, it looks a lot more like Gargo. When it's on my hand, it looks nothing like it, but yeah. And it does smell really nice, actually. It reminds me of something that I've used before, but I can't think what it is. 
and yeah that's a little haul um i said they weren't much and um can't really afford to be buying that much lately um it's insurance on cars now is just absolutely mad as you all probably know anyway that's uh, my little haul and i'll see you again soon bye